Another top story tonight, a suspected serial killer accused of murdering three people in just five days. Dallas police say this could be the person killing transgender women. He's charged in the death of Malaysia Booker. Here's Teresa Woodard with the investigation. How many murders might be solved with the arrest of Kendrell LeVar Lyles is a mystery. Also a mystery, why this 33-year-old went on an alleged killing spree in the month of May. We don't know the motives at this point. Police believe Lyles killed Malaysia Booker on May 18th. Booker is a transgender woman who drew national attention for surviving this brutal beating weeks before her death. On May 22nd, Police say Lyles shot and killed a woman in an apartment complex on McCallum in far north Dallas. On May 23rd, they think he killed a man half a mile away during a drug deal at a strip mall parking lot on Coit. And on June 1st, police found the body of Chanel Lindsay, another transgender woman in White Rock Lake. Police call Lyles a person of interest in her death. Investigators zeroed in on Lyles, they say, after a tip from someone close to him. And that witness was able to provide details that were known only to the suspect. Witnesses tied Lyles to the far north Dallas murders, but DPD detectives did the rest. Discovering Lyles' car matched the vehicle Malaysia Booker had last been seen in. They say cell phone records put him at the site where Booker died. And police are not done. They are looking into other unsolved murders, including a transgender woman in 2018. And we'll look to see if there are ties to Lyles to those other cases. One man charged with three murders in one month, and there could be more. In Dallas, I'm Teresa Wood.